Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm gonna show you exactly how to install Feather Client, even if you're using T Loucher or any other cracked Minecraft launcher. A lot of people get confused with this, but don't worry, I've got you covered, step by step. So let's jump right into it. All right, first things first, open up your browser and head to the official Feather Client website. That's feathermeek.com. Once you're there, scroll down just a little until you see the download for fabric button. Go ahead and click that. Now, since I've already got Feather installed on my system, I don't need to do it again. But if you haven't yet, make sure to let that download finish completely. It shouldn't take too long, depending on your internet speed. Once that's done, we're not finished yet, because you'll also need Fabric itself. So, open a new tab and go to fabricmc.net slash use slash installer. That's where you'll get the Fabric. When the site loads, click on Download Universal Installer. It works on pretty much every system. Once it's downloaded, open the file and you'll see a small setup window. From here, choose Minecraft version 1.21.5, and leave everything else as default unless you know what you're doing. Now, click Install, and just like that, Fabric will set up a modded Minecraft profile for you. Easy stuff. Okay, once Fabric is installed, go ahead and open up T-Loucher, wait for it to load, and once you're in, scroll through the version list. You should see something that says Fabric Loader 1, 21.5. If you don't see it, make sure you installed Fabric correctly. It might say beta or experimental version, but don't worry about that, go ahead and launch the game anyway. The first startup might take a minute or two, but that's totally normal, just sit back and let it do its thing. And there we go! Once Minecraft launches, you'll notice that Feather Client is now fully loaded. You'll see a brand new interface with custom settings, FPS boosts, and a bunch of other cool features that make Minecraft run super smooth. Now, let's check it out in-game. Go ahead and click single player, load up a world, or make a new one if you want. Once you're inside, you can already feel the difference. Everything's smoother, the frames are higher, and the UI looks awesome. Let's open up the feather settings real quick. You'll find tons of customization options here. Performance tweaks, visual changes, HUD settings, and even a built-in mod manager. It's really powerful for a lightweight client. You can adjust things like your FPS display, zoom key, or HUD layout, whatever fits your style. And if you're into PvP or building, Feather Client makes everything feel so much cleaner and more responsive. Honestly, once you get used to it, you'll never want to go back to vanilla Minecraft. Alright, that's pretty much it for the setup. If you followed all the steps, you should now have Feather Client run ING perfectly on Cloucher or any cracked launcher you're using. If something doesn't work, maybe it crashes or doesn't show up. Double check your Minecraft version, make sure you installed Fabric correctly, and confirm that Feather is in your mods folder. Nine times out of ten, that'll fix it. And if you're still stuck, drop a comment down below. I'll try to help you out as soon as I can. Anyway guys, that's all for today's video. I really hope this tutorial helped you out. If it did, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe to the channel for more Minecraft content, and maybe even turn on those notifications so you never miss a new upload. Thanks for watching everyone, I'll see you in the next one, and until then, peace out.